Hello friends, welcome to Tech Accessibility Tutorials. This is Vaishnavi here. So friends, in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up UPI payments method in WhatsApp and how to use it. So friends, if you want to get this feature, you need to update to the latest beta version of WhatsApp available on the Play Store. Otherwise, you need to wait until this feature arrives to the WhatsApp stable update. So friends, this payments method is located under the attached section of the WhatsApp. So friends, without any delay, let's get started. Now I'm gonna double tap on WhatsApp. WhatsApp. What? Now I have already opened a chat which has a payments method set up already. So now I'm gonna double tap on attach button just above the edit box and right beside the camera button. So I'm gonna swipe right until I hear attach button. Emoji button. Type of message. Edit box. Attach button. So let's double tap on attach button here and swipe right until you hear payments. Document button. Document. Payment, payment. So let's double tap on payments here. So let's hear what it will say. Send and receive money securely with UPI. So I'm going to swipe right. Tap accept and continue to accept the WhatsApp payments terms and privacy policy and the payment provider's terms and privacy policy. So I'm going to swipe right until you hear done button or accept and continue button. Terms and privacy policy. Terms and privacy policy. Accept and continue button. So we have to double tap on this accept and continue button. And you need to wait for a few seconds to get the list of banks. Getting the list of banks. So you can hear getting the list of banks. Zero. So friends here you can see a lot of banks. Access Bank Limited. HDFC Bank LTD. The Sissy Bank. You can navigate to the each bank by swiping right with one finger. State Bank of India. Yes Bank Limited. So I'm gonna swipe up with two fingers to get my bank quickly so i'm gonna scroll up dhsbc bank so i'm gonna double tap on the bank which has my account so it's taking few seconds to get my account details zero zero it shows all the bank accounts linked to my account select a bank account to add the following bank accounts are linked to your phone number so i'm gonna swipe right Bank 2031. So we have to double tap on this and again swipe right with one finger. Vishnavi, yes. So we need to double tap on this as well. So it will take few seconds again. Setup complete. You can now send payments in WhatsApp. Open the chat and tap percent as to start sending. Done button. So we need to double tap on this done button to finish the setup. Care zero zero. So friends, once the payment method has been set up, now you will be able to send the money through WhatsApp payments method. But the thing is, you and the other person both should set up the payment method in WhatsApp. Without the other person doing it, you will not be able to send the amount to the other person who doesn't use WhatsApp payments method. So let's open WhatsApp and learn how to transfer money. WhatsApp 31. So I have opened a chat here on the WhatsApp already. So let's double tap on attach button. Emoji. Type of message. Attach button. Now swipe right until you hear payments method or payments. Do document. Payment. Payment. So let's double tap on payments. Here you can see. To Pram using profile drop down list. Care of Visaya Bank 2031 via UPI. So I'm going to swipe right. Rupee. Editing. Zero. Edit box. So in the edit box, you can type the amount. For instance, I'm typing 50. Two, five, five, zero, zero. Okay, I'm gonna press back button to hide the keyboard. So add a note, edit um, okay. fifty, edit box. So I have typed fifty. I'm gonna swipe right. Emoji button. So I'm gonna swipe right again. Add a note, edit box. So in this edit box, you can type any note like remarks. If you want to type anything, you can type it here. Send button. So let's double tap on send button. Now it will ask you to enter your UPI PIN. Enter your UPI PIN. Looks like you already have a UPI PIN for account 2031. Enter it on the next screen to send your payment. So I'm going to swipe right. Don't know your UPI PIN. So if you don't know your UPI PIN, you can set up here. And if you know, just swipe right. Enter UPI PIN button. 
so double tap on this enter UPI pin as I know my UPI pin already enter edit box. so in this edit box you have to enter your UPI pin so for entering each digit you have to double tap on the number zero pausing the recording I have typed my UPI pin then after typing you can see an unlabeled button on the right bottom corner of the screen nine unlabeled button just double tap on this unlabeled button it's done button or next button please wait a moment so it says please wait a moment today 12 colon 0 4 pm set processing 50 0, 0. so it says processing 50 0, 0. so within a few minutes or few seconds the 50 rupees will be sent to the person to whom I have sent. Zero. So friends, now it says Today, 12 colon 0, 4 pm, delivered, complete, 50, 0, 0. So it says 50 complete, previously it said 50 processing. So friends, if you want to send amount in the group, open the group, then double tap on attach button, then double tap on payment, then it will show the list of contacts, then choose the contact who has the payment method set up already and send the amount. Friends, if you want interesting technical videos like this, click on subscribe button, then click on bell icon. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and if you have any suggestions and feedback, write in the comment section and please share this video with your friends on Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus and WhatsApp. Thanks for watching this video. Zero.